welcome back everybody, Cyan here. I've just been uh, kind of sort of running through the jungle and I noticed something, yeah, let me get that out of the way, something going on underneath me. Corpse petals, right? Uh, I didn't want to pick that crap up, but I did. Okay. Can I get rid of the last part, please? Corpse bloom. Yeah, this is a... Uh, Remember a couple episodes ago I said there was something that shows up after, in the jungle after Skeletron is defeated? Oh, my party girl finally showed up. Cool. It's this thing. A little bit of a joke monster, I guess. You know, it's not terribly tough. All it does is it spawns bunch of little flying guys, and I was cutting through them so quick that, yeah. Okay, not as bad as I thought it would be, but... Alright, and there we go. Release a corpse bloom withers and decays away. Cool. Uh, Anchor of the wind. Awesome. And that stuff's trash. Bloom guard. Summons a bloom bolt that periodically generates booster spores. Touching the spores increases defense and life regeneration briefly. Uh, just so there's no recall. No. What, water walking? No. Torches? Yes. Honey dispenser. Ow! Freaking. Granite energy core. Awesome. Freaking enemies, though, that come through the walls at you. Uh, let's see. What to keep, what not to keep. Uh, that is trash. And... Healing potions I can take. Splunker, I kind of want to take, actually. But I don't need it, so... It can stay behind for now. I have been throwing things into my piggy bank, which probably... Let's do that again. Open up, put that in there, dispenser, bloom guard. Okay. Wonder how long the thing sticks around for. Because that's kind of cool. I could actually use that. Okay, I get a uh, like a, a nine, ten second buff. Cool. Um. Okay, I get rid of that. Defense is thirty-seven. Ah, oh, man. Dang it. So defense is 37, and if I touch this, 42, so it gives me plus 5 defense, actually that's not too bad. And I got that for killing the uh, corpse bloom thingy, huh? Got another lava charm. First time I've ever found two in one world. I am actually slightly excited about that. A couple more suspicious looking eyes. Alright, there's that. I'm going to get rid of the granite blocks because I can get as much as I want elsewhere. I don't need them clogging up my inventory here, so... Alright. Okay, that thing out of here. Okay, we found a beehive too. Awesome. And another granite biome. So let's come over here and we'll like say that. Oh, I am poisoned. It's not not make me happy, but not much we can do about it. Let's see. Back here's where I started the video at. So Alright, let me out. Thank you. Here we go, and there's a portal up here that I found. As well as this, but the other half's gone. The, uh, the actual trigger for this thing is not around, so... Bit of a shame. I mean, that is a big chunk of platinum, which I may get later. But I just really like making things like that blow up. So we are going from here, by this portal. Oh, it, is it the portal that goes... Here, maybe? No, that one, it goes to there. Okay, being shot. Alright. Well, we're not in the jungle anymore. Uh, where are we? Oh, wow. Uh, that's a pretty good jump. We're actually under the desert. That's kind of cool. What is that below us there? Okay, come on, let me down. Thank you. Oh, that's just Malachite. Okay. Well... Hmm. Interesting. Leads me to a little dead-end cave, so I mean, that's not, that's not the greatest, but... Oh, well. Whoop. There we go. The reason why the one in the dungeon kept hurting me is because I couldn't leave the vicinity of the portal quick enough, and the debuff it had was causing damage. Okay, what are you... Abomination? What the heck? Okay, yeah, you hurt a decent amount. Okay. And apparently when I kill you, your skeleton comes out. Okay, interesting. 
Got some more mud zombies here. And army ants. It's kind of funny, you only ever seen one army ant at a time. Ow. Heal. Come on. You guys, thank you for dying. Alright, and I kind of want this out for over here if I can get it. Okay, that was lovely. Alright. Stupid little bees. Oh, and I got shot again. Oh, that was great. Alright. <clears throat> oh. Let's try this again. Well, the trencher's dead. Um, hmm. I definitely want to get into this beehive. So, I'm going to kind of cheese my way in. And actually, I feel a little better about what I'm going to do because I know the queen bee is not right below me. So. Okay, four of these. That's all I have to deal with. It's just four of these little guys. And the granite element. Go away. Oh, well, granite core. That's kind of nice, I guess. That line of mud there is a little strange, isn't it? Oh, that's silt. Okay. Ew, okay. Um, put like that, I guess. That's more silt. I can't do that. Okay, that was close. I almost got the... Almost woke up to Queenie. Alright. Thank you. Awesome. Uh, presents can get thrown away. I mainly am just wanting like a little bit of a platform here to stand on. I mean, is that so much to ask for? I can't even swing the high blocks around. Okay. Would you freaking... Oh, and another one. Alright, ow, and an army ant. Okay, great. Good, you're dead. Can you stay that way now? I don't want that. Blood fang. Okay, cool. Don't need that. Jungle rose. Uh, it is material, though. Okay. And that can go. Okay. Queen bee. Buff. Alright, and get in here. Ow. Of course, you come in like right there. I think I'm doing this in a little bit different order though. I don't I think aren't you supposed to go like the jungle first before? You, okay, let's not get stuck in the lava, shall we? Yeah, aren't you supposed to go the jungle before you go to the dungeon? And G Realms critters need to leave me alone right now, thank you. Normally, I'm rather fond of them, however, right this second, not nearly as much. I'm trying to fight a boss, damn it. Okay, that one's Trimmer's mod, Trimmer mod's fault. Well, what was there a bee in the, yeah, there was a bee in the freaking honey waiting for me. God. Nope. All right, come on. No, don't do the stingers. Come on. Do the bees. Do the little bees. Okay. Yeah, thank you. That was helpful. What the? All right. You're doing more now. Now you're doing the little bees. Okay. Now you're back to stingers. Because you're a bitch. All right, come on. I'm not really in danger of, like, dying, per se. I am in danger, though, of just getting annoyed. Ow. You legitimately fired one bee at me and then switched to stingers. Just 
Good guy. Thank you. Oh, we're back to the beast. Oh, you're dead. Alright. Beast dead? I think the bees are dead. Okay, I got the treasure bag. I got some bottled honey. I found a uh, bronze alloy fragments. That comes from the marble biomes, actually. And let's see. Trencher carapace. That's kind of nice, actually. Let's get into here. Oh, hello, bat. What the hell was hitting me? Be a bat. Oh, look at this. Jungle treasure. Auto chests have refilled or have stocked. Okay. Uh, loot. Oh, okay. I love it. There's a giant tree right in the middle of the goddamn granite lamp. Okay. Don't need cobwebs or rich mahogany. Quite fine without it. Still have my dark caster banner on me, huh? Oops. Don't really need any of that. So we're just going to. Oh, I didn't want the ghost residue either. All right. I'll turn now to auto mine. Thank you. Now, can I in the. I have some, like, granite enemies, please? Kinda want more cores, you know. Kinda have to have the granite enemies to do it, though. Alright. Get another vine. Got another one of these guys. Who's dead now? Oh, I see a jungle thing over there, though. Ah, oh, here we go. Alright, now if the bee would quit hammering me into the friggin' elemental, much better. Batman. Alright, and... Oh, thank you. What are you? Feral Claws. Feral Claws can be fun, actually. More healing potions, sure. I'm not sure we can stay put for now. I might... I'm not even really that fond of how those chests look, so I might just... Oh, okay. Hi. Oh, wow. I kind of walked into a shitstorm here, didn't I? What are you, anyway? I have no idea. I killed you first. That was a regular B. It wasn't firing things that looked like freaking bullets that misses at me, though. Alright, and... Of course not. Okay. Mahogany end. Alright. Kogi D. The Witch Doctor. Okay. What is. Oh, there's one of you guys. I couldn't see it under the. Oh my god. Fighting that thing underwater. Not recommended. What are you anyway? It's a regular hornets, but why are you sparkling? You found coins somewhere then, huh? Oh, hey, you. Come here. Uh, I see candy canes. Ah, much better. Okay. So I have the witch doctor now, too. Couple hornet there. Okay, what are you? You're a regular hornet, but you're shooting, like, anti-personnel missiles at me. Why? Oh, hi, Trencher. Goodbye, Trencher. Actually, that's pretty handy. I don't even have to dig through the trunk of this tree. What is it? Oh, the boomstick. And the mahogany wands. Okay, I kind of want the mahogany wands, though. To be honest. Come here. Thank you. Great. Awesome. Got the carapace. That is a jungle rose. Are those even materials? They are. Hmm. Hive wall times 70. Mm, no thanks. Alright, so, come over here, oh, yep, of course, you can make that jump, not a problem. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, hello, snail. I'm being joined by a snail. Uh, let's see, though. Presents, don't really want those. I want that. I want the healing potions. Gravitation potion would be nice if I had room for it, but I don't. Gold coin? Is rather nice. I don't need those. Oh man, he killed the snail. You bastard. Uh, da, 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 da. Lignum the druid has arrived. Interesting. I forgot about the druid. Uh, ha, 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 ha. Well, I have two junker roses. That's probably not a bad idea, actually. I've already got a honey dispenser. I'm looking for. 
Oh, and you gotta be kidding me. Did it again. Got stuck on glow sticks. Are you really just a regular hornet? Yeah, I guess. But... Oh, my god. Alright. Probably the French are dead. Ow. You freaking. Flying biomass. Get back here, Trencher. There we go. Alright, what to get rid of to. Because this. I already, like I said, I have a honey dispenser. It's in my piggy bank, but. Close enough, right? Um. Sort of other, I don't need hive blocks. Actually, I really don't. I don't even have a hive wand to place those with. So, maybe right, ghostly residue can get trashed as well. Awesome. So, whoop. Okay. Now come over here by our statues and stuff. And already has ca copies of all those. Okay, that works for me. Now let's go. Uh, let's go interrogate the guide. Hey. Zack, I'm gonna help crafting. All right, what all can you use for just lightning boots? Okay, not a problem. Uh, blood fangs are for barbaric warlord helmets. Okay, that is a hard mode thing. And let's see, you are the enamel cannon, arcane welding station. And it requires ectoplasm. Okay, piranha pore made from a gill storm. Oh, remember that? That was fun. The Tropicuda. Charbone Blade. I'm going to have to go... Yeah, the Decryptor. Oh, yeah. Fires Bone Bolts and Tomb bo Bolts. Rest in peace. It's the Javelin Chucker. Fires any Javelin. From G-Realm, though. Hmm. And then Barbaric Javelin. 101 throwing damage. Faces two tiles for a short while. Can be used as a spear in close combat. Awesome. Okay. Blood fangs. Want a lot of them. Uh, feral claws. What do you use for now? Uh, just power gloves? Okay. Easy enough. How about the honey? Abominations, and I can make my own honey fins from bass. Oh, that's cool. Uh, let's see. The jungle rose. What are you for? Staff of regrowth. Oh, that's awesome. Sweet. Flower boots. Oh, I can make that... I've got extra Hermes boots right now. The Flower of Fire. Healing Flower. Automatically quick heals when necessary. The Herbal Greenhouse. Grows plants. Done. I'm going to need like 80 clay pots. 200 dirt's not a problem. 100 diamond gem spark blocks. I just need more glass for this actually. And glass chest. Which I think means I need a blast furnace. Okay. Uh, bronze alloy fragments. I can make... Basically, hoplite armor. Cool. Gladius, greaves, helmet, mallet, packs. Packs, huh? Yep. Pickaxe and axe. Cool. Spear. Bronze throwing axe. Gorgon gaze and staff. Cool. Gorgon coating. Throwing techs have a chance to pen or petrify enemies. Cool. Okay. Too bad it's only throwing, but. Uh, granite energy cores? Oh, wow. I mean, the main thing is the unstable core, right? Which I need one more of these cores. Okay. But you can make, like, armor out of this stuff? 20 of them. 11 defense. 14 for the affluent armor. 11 is actually pretty damn good for pretty hard mode. The granite crossbow. Turns wooden arrows into granite arrows. Granite arrows might overflow the enemy. Might overflow the enemy with energy, causing damage and lowering defense. Defense will be energized. 10 defense. Wow. Granite hammocks is 60 and 60. This is 160. Okay. Granite helmet. Granite pick is 95% pickaxe power. Interesting. Reflector, which is just regular bow. I'm guessing. It kind of looks like a bow. I'm not sure. The granite saber. Hmm. Granite throwing axe is 24 throwing damage. Wow. Spick me. I like that. Uh, rich mahogany. Leaf wand. Bombs. 
Did I ever look to see? It's a log zooka. <laughs> I love that thing. Oh, it requires cobalt, though. Ooh, I forgot about that. The wood chipper is the first one. Oh, I can make my own bomb statues. Cool. Bouncy bombs. Sticky bombs. All right. Good to know. Purification powder. Is so I can purify directly in my inventory more efficiently. Cool. And what are you? Spellbook Purify is thorium bars, required bookcase. And all requires is four five thorium bars and a book. And the scroll town port. Okay. That actually, uh, thorium and a book, huh? At a bookcase. All right, let go. All right, well. Uh, furniture. I have bookcases. Uh, let's see. I have thorium. And books I've been putting in with furniture, I believe. Yep. There we go. So, this is where my base starts looking like a mess, but... Renew. Uses 30 mana to recover 25 life. Defense, life regeneration, and movement speed are sapped for a short duration. Okay, never mind. Oh, wow. Cool. I like that. It just lets me purify with mana instead. Awesome. So, since last episode, I also made this guy the Dungeon Crawlomatic chest. I put in a Star Fury, my godly Star Fury, actually, and my Ancient Shadow Armor. And it's just been sitting here collecting stuff for me books, water candles. It's got a key. Actually, it's gotten several keys. I left one in there. Bones, blue bricks, so on and so forth. Uh, some cobwebs. I don't know why cobwebs, but okay. So it's just been kind of chugging right along for me, which is great. Now, I've got a druid I want to see. Hello, and a party girl. Cool. Lignum. Free herbs. Oh, I'm just gonna see. Okay. Every once in a while you can get free stuff, and I can buy whatever I want here. Life Disperser. Healer class. Okay. Ranger's Tunic. It's a vanity item. Alright. Ranger's Cowl. Oh, okay. So I can dress like the druid. Gusty Leaf. Consumable. Increases jump height and negates fall damage for three minutes. Hmm. And then I can buy any of the flowers for 20 silver apiece. Alright. Cool. Alright. Kogigi. Oh, okay. Dark Mages. Alright, and we have the different fountains. Cool. The imbuing station. Seaweed for summoning a pet turtle. Oh, you can just get that straight from him now, huh? And then, kind of fittingly, the party girl is here. And she's got a strange plant growing on the floor. Hmm. Silly balloon machine. Party hat. Party center. Firework fountain. Fireworks box. Lava lamp. Bubble wand. Confetti. Bubble machine. Smoke. Uh, smoke grenades, smoke bombs, confetti gun. Oh, you can buy a beach ball from her now, huh? Cool. Uh, let's see. I've beaten Skeletron. You got anything new for me? Yes, you do. Whirlpool Saber. Unleashes, swings unleash a torrential pulse with high knockback. Pulse can phase through walls. Okay. It's only 19 damage, but I can, if I, I can attack through walls with it. First electrical sparks have a chance to paralyze to hit enemy very briefly. Boss monsters are not affected, pretty much. Marine launcher uses little torpedoes as ammunition. This is 23, so 27, huh? But it's like the first rocket launcher you can get your hands on. Uh, use the marine launcher, it explodes upon impacting an enemy. Hmm. And I can get some diver stuff now, too. All right. Okay, it's a pity this thing sucks damage-wise. 33, 19, because, uh, is it auto-swing too? Yes, it is. Oops, I just killed, uh, Karu's Blink Root by accident. Uh, the Snowball. 32 magic damage, uses 9 mana. And, yeah, nope, no thanks. Nope. However, Joseph... Yes, I would like to buy a safe. Thank you very much. And what the hell, cookie? One minute duration increases life regeneration. Hmm. Cool. 
Uh, Mr. Barney, the cobbler. Yes. Water walking boots and Hermes boots. Cool. Landing on the ground and releases a powerful shock wave. Mm. Too bad I can't, like, tag all these into one. Oh, that would be great. Water walking boots, though. Cool. Um... Andre, what do you got for me? It's new. Nothing. All right, you suck. Karu. Uh, looks like you're about the same. Yeah, you kind of are. Okay. You're boring. Going away. Hey, they're talking about your feet up there. Okay, so I've killed that. So I get access to buying the abomination now. Cool. Little on the spendy side, but oh well. You know, is what it is. Five defender medals, huh? I've got two. Thank you. Got another giant bow. Um. Okay, I already checked out your shop. The nurse. Oliver. Amy Oliver. Here we go. Got nothing new, huh? But you can buy a bow from me. Uh, I'm not gonna argue. And I guess I'll sell you the those bombs, so. Please. Right where I wanted to be. Because I am grabbing some strange plants out of here. We're gonna go talk to the die guy before I end the episode off. Let's see if I can get something new and fancy. Alright, strange plants. There we go. Alright, cool. What did I get? Uh, reflective gold dye. Purple ooze. Reflective dye. And reflective metal. And six red acids, huh? Alright, well, I've got some red acids, so. Sell that off to you for gold and 20. For six. That's actually pretty cheap. Uh, let's see, what are you? Just simple reflective, huh? Purple ooze. Nah, I'm gonna pass. Thanks. Uh, same as reflective gold, I think. Now, right now, I've got Mirage die on my armor. The main reason for that was just to have somewhere to put it. So, what happens if I put... Like that, and... Yeah. Whee! Uh... Not that fond of that either, so shop. Go here and uh, like reflect the metal. I guess I'm just gonna sell it off actually. Uh, I might keep it for my lantern. Got reflective silver on my, my grappling hook though. Um, and on my wings. Dude, what the heck is going on? Why do I hear breaking glass over there? And let's see. Hmm. Just gonna sell off the bronze stuff now. I am a little low on money, so okay. Java Hawk, what exactly do you do to attack? You throw beer at him. Oh, okay. Well, there we go. Thank you. Your rate of fire sucks, but all right. How is my wood doing anyway? I haven't checked in a while. Uh, I've got a thousand and two wood in there for free, pretty much. I mean, that's doing pretty good. And... Almost two full stacks of stars. Cool. Yeah, I have a safe now, which will definitely help with inventory stuff. Tools. Uh, the leaf wand, the living mahogany wand can go. Oh, yes. Queen bee hag. Okay. Or treasure bag. So, beeswax, alright. Hive pack increases the strength of friendly bees. That would be nice if I was doing anything with bees. Oh god. Did not realize how many Nazars I had, or Nazars, or whatever. Um, put that away in there. Uh, the hive wand, which is definitely a tool. And, okay. Oh, yes, reflective die. Probably just go ahead and sell that off. 
Uh, oh, and the beekeeper, huh? Is that a material by any chance now? No, it's not. Surprised nobody's made a recipe using it in one of their mods yet. All right, uh, Geralt. Geralt. You're gonna buy some stuff from me, buddy. There we go, 51 gold again. And I'm just gonna sell off the reflective die too, I guess. Bee nades are fun, I will keep those actually. And the bees wax, isn't it? It's pretty much like the bee armor and stuff. Yeah, oh, and what are you at the end here? Honey blade from Thorium. Oh, requires souls, huh? 38 summon damage, throws out a hive of bees on a swing. I can make more bee nades, I guess. Hornet staff. Thank you, go away. That's the anvil, right? The hornets are actually pretty good as long as you're not in water. So, hornet staff, yes. I will take that. So I can actually have a somewhat decent minion that works like he's supposed to and doesn't despawn. Actually, I'm just gonna do that now. And like say here, we're just going to go beeswax down there, same with that. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna collect a few more of these jungle roses though too. Come on, quick stack nearby. Thank you. Say accessory and just gonna leave one nazar in here. That's all more I need really. Walking launches up granite particles. See, that'd be cool if I could throw it into the. Well, maybe it will work in here. That's what I was thinking. Like, oh well, maybe I can get it to work. No, not quite. How about now? Okay, yeah, no. Oh, that, no. No. Nope. Nope. There you go. You can keep it. But let's see. Increases minion damage. Increases minion damage. I mean, okay, I've got two of those, but. Increases the strength of friendly bees. Yeah, I mean, using some of the accessories that come with the, the subset of, oh my god, of the fireflies. Oh, and I get the honey goggles. Oh, hey now. I am replacing that slime saddle, that's for certain. And I guess mounts can go into tools for now, too. Oh, I'm too tall to go through the doorway, so. Wee. Oh yeah, I can definitely fly faster and farther. Oh wow. Okay, I thought this guy got tired after a while, but uh, I just hit the top of the map without a problem. Now if I do that, then I can glide down anywhere I want. Should just barely miss that skyland up there, but... Oh well. Oh, God, he took off like a shot, too. He was just like, alright, we're going. And, yeah. He's tired still. Okay, that was close. Yep, and... Ow. Thank you. Hmm. Okay. Definitely cool. I got I got the beat. I got a flying mount. So, that's awesome. I like that. Uh, let's see. Though. I think what I am going to do, though, is I'm going to go to the granite biome below me here. I'm going to get a bunch of uh, granite cores and stuff together. And we'll, uh, we'll go from there. So, But until next time, sign signing out. Have fun.